Has this ever happened to you? You're watching a stock and out of nowhere, the stock quickly runs higher. There's no news or earnings or any catalyst that pushed the security up. So why did it occur? This could be due to something called consolidation, which we will cover in this video. We will also go over how many traders use the strap method to trade consolidation. You don't want to miss out on this lesson, so stay tuned for after the disclaimer. So what is consolidation? Consolidation is when price gets tighter and tighter, often between levels of support and resistance, and eventually is forced to break out in a direction. Traders often try and predict this direction. Stratters are different as they use facts to trade. Those who trade with the strat method recognize consolidation as an inside bar, because if you place lines of support and resistance from the highs and the lows of an inside bar and the candle before that, it forms a triangle shape which means price is getting closer and closer together. During consolidation, the market hasn't decided where to take the price, bullish or bearish. So when either buyers or sellers take control is when many stratters like to trade. It is possible to trade between the support and resistance lines, such as playing reversals at these points, but many traders instead prefer to wait for a breakout. What confirms as a breakout? Well, confirmation ultimately depends on the comfort level of the trader, but most traders choose their confirmation of a breakout when price closes past a level of support or resistance. Because most traders choose this, it adds power to the breakout because there are many traders anticipating the same thing. After a breakout, there is often a pullback, which is a short reversal that can retest the level it just broke through. It doesn't have to retest it, but it often does. If the pullback again closes or confirms however the trader's confirmation is back past the level, it is a false breakout. Most traders are hoping for a simple bounce off the level and signs of a continuation of the breakout. This is where strat traders come in. This pullback may form a reversal combo. So in this chart, we see consolidation with a bearish 2-2 reversal as the pullback. This pullback bounces off of the resistance line turned support that the price just broke through and forms another 2-2 reversal, only this time it is bullish. Then the chart continues upward for a massive breakout. Now a strat trader in real time would only see the bearish 2-2 reversal or the pullback. So in anticipation of a successful retest and a continuation of the breakout, he or she may set an entry price one cent above the last two candle they see and a few target prices. Let's look at another example. In this chart, there is again consolidation. Now, on the bullish breakout, it is a new day, which creates the gap. There is first a pullback, which creates a bullish 2-2 reversal, which would have hit a target price of the close of this candle, and then a bearish 2-2 reversal, which a trader could have taken, and then a bullish 2-1-2 reversal, where a big run comes after, hitting multiple price targets. If you enjoyed this video, you would very likely enjoy and benefit from the Ultimate Technical Analysis course, which has all of these strategies and more. What you learned in this video is really just a fraction of what you will learn in this course, and there is also a 30-day refund policy. If that all sounds good, head over to the link in the description. The first 1,000 people receive 30% off of the course. That's the video. Thank you for watching.